So this is it. Domestic football across the continent may all be done and dusted in the major leagues. But now we have the ultimate spectacle to conclude the season. The earliest phase in qualifying started way back at the beginning of last summer. And now there are just two teams standing. A show not just for the capacity crowd here, but one for the whole world. The global audience, they say, some 300 million. So we're almost there. All one can see, a look of utter focus on the faces of all involved. You've been there, Jim Beglin. What will they be thinking as they wait for the whistle? Well, you're right, Peter, I have been in this position. And the message is usually something like, remember all the work, the hard work you put in to get this far. So don't leave anything out there now. Do what you're good at. It's better than what they can offer. Stick to that, and you hope it'll be enough. As you can see, we've already started here. Look, we can only hope for a final that will be free-flowing and end-to-end -end and, and highly entertaining, but fear of defeat can often dominate emotions, so don't... Rabio! He scored! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. <laughs> Juventus take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Real chance! Di Maria quickly realised that he could have a pop, not his best. Mbappe takes it out to the wing. Marco Verratti. He's had a go! And he's straight offside. Danilo. Chiesa. Chiesa on a strong run down the right. It's broken loose. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Hakimi. Well read, he sorted that out. Well played, he saw that coming. Vinealdum, and it's gay. It's gay! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. That's a pop! Kimpembe decides to play it back. And here's Ferrati. Gay. That has sent him sprawling. Oh, it's a foul. It could be a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Paris Saint-Germain with this to level it up. A formality. We're level. He was just never going to miss. Oh, you could always see he was confident about that. He always looked like he was going to score. <laughs> that has certainly made things interesting. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback, and this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can 
go one better, possibly. It's a loose ball. And now the breakaway. Now it's Neymar. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And it's Morata. Now it's Morata. Cristiano Ronaldo. Tries a header! He's done very well to get to that. Morata simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Neymar. Forward it goes. Rabio cuts it out. Midway through the first period, and it's looking quite a game here. And here's Morata. Chiesa. Morata. Kimpembe. Now it's Neymar. Di Maria. He's played him through. A great ball. Kimpembe. Mbappe. Hakimi. Now it's Morata. Morata. Let's go for goal! Dybala battles to win it back. Idris again, he's given away a free kick. And no surprise, that's a booking. Brilliant save from Tolaruma! That's a fine save. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. Neymar. Gets away from his opponents. He's good for it. Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! And the comeback is complete. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things. Just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Saint-Germain take the lead. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Shoots! Try, can't have good, so easily a bit different. Cristiano Ronaldo usually is so good from that range, he didn't quite connect as he can, though. And a shot! Dybala. A oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. Idrissa Gay demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. Marco Verratti. Kimpembe plays it forward. Danilo. Tries to get it forward quickly. Rabio. Kimpembe drives it forward. Mbappe. Well positioned to make that interception. Cristiano Ronaldo. Hoists it high. Now it's Morata. Morata shoots! Oh, shame, that was nicely worked. Almost the perfect move. Almost. The finish just wasn't quite at the same level. Paris Saint-Germain, get it back again. Dybala. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. Plays it into the box. Well weighted. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. 
shapes to shoot. Big relief, it just needed better contact. And it's played forward. Marco Verratti. And it's Verratti. Di Maria! Oh, denied brilliantly! Di Maria is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Juventus have it back and they can go again. Dybala. Oh, he's broken through. Oh, that's a waste. Hoists it forward. Well, it really is one cross after another. Well, with a target to hit, why not keep up the supply? It's simple and, and efficient because they all know what they're doing. It's Rabio! Straight at the keeper. That's just literally playing into his hands. Rabio goes looking. Pumps it in gently. Going for goal! Had a swing, but it wasn't to be. Ah, that's unlucky. The idea was really smart for me, and, and he's had a good go at it. Sergio Ramos tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Dybala spreads it towards the left. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Di Maria takes the long option. Dybala hoists it forward. Morata gets it out to the wing. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Marco Verratti. Mbappe gets wrestled off the ball. Chiesa. He spotted the run and played him through. Morata! Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Chance to break. Mbappe. Now it's Di Maria. Hakimi. Good challenge. He just stood firm. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Gets the better of his man. Di Maria, done very well to intervene. And it's Dybala, and he has been fouled there. Dybala, Di and Dybala! He's pulled off a fine save. Paolo Dybala really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Massive leap! He can pounce on that. What a match we have! Donnarumma reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. I might sound a little harsh here, but the keeper, I felt, could have done a better job in ensuring that ball didn't go back out into the danger area. This is quite a battle. Well, from such a showpiece final as well, I think this is exactly the type of excitement that all the neutrals would have wanted on show. There's so many twists and turns in this game, it's a pleasure to watch. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. He's through. Cut out in the nick of time. This is gone. And we've reached the halfway point of the final. Paris Saint-Germain come out of a half that has been quite extraordinary on many counts. High scoring, truly exciting, but neither side able to hold a lead. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? 
Look, this is highly entertaining and exact. It's one! It's in! And some players are just capable of grabbing a game by the scruff of the neck. And his immense talent may just have done exactly that and injected the belief that they can retain their lead this time round. Time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves into the lead. Well, this is just fantastic, Peter. I think we all got the final we wanted. Um, we can all now enjoy it for what it is. Towering header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases the chances of the ball being met like that. Neymar! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Morata puts his foot on the gas. Cristiano Ronaldo. Morata. He gets big chance! Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Morata cannot be a happy chappy, and you can understand why. The run was stoic, and it should have been heroic. Chiesa! Oh, that is rather wayward. Kimpembe. Dybala. Driving on, he could shoot here. Hits one. He's got away with one there. Gets up to head it. Decent attempt, but... Not quite good enough. Oh, he's for... And the shot! There's a goal! You know, we may be looking at another classic here, and I'm not going to guess what's going to happen next, but that is great togetherness and resolve. High quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. So all square, and not for the first time. Well, they just couldn't have responded any better, Peter. Yeah, there's the old cliche about how teams can lose focus after scoring, but you still have to take your chances. Brilliant. It's a good foot in there. And the shot! Dybala drives it forward. Now it's Morata. And it's Di Maria. Di Maria, this is promising. Over to the left. Offside that time. Chesney sends that a long way. And here's Morata. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Morata really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Neymar. It's Neymar! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Goes for goal! Good effort first time. Listen, I'm not sure he had to go at that first time, but at least he showed some good confidence. Forward it goes. Was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Questions were asked. He's given the answers. 
Mbappe! Mbappe! Oh, surely that deserves better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Oh, a checking back like that always. A... And they've been caught out here. That's a... That's a hit! And for a moment, time stood still. Sergio Ramos positions himself well and cuts it out. Neymar. This defence is, is weary of that opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Chiesa. Danilo. Danilo plays it forward. Hakimi. Oh, good interception. And it's played forward. Benatesti. Benatesti! It's been taken short. Forward it goes. Brought forward. What does he try from here? Going through. Neymar. And he's cut it out. Chesney can hoist it clear. And he's there to clear it. A little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Kimpembe clips one through. A forward pass. Just brushed off the ball there. Hakimi. Hakimi drives it forward. Nicely measured pass. What a sight of goal here. Shot a goal! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! Got their lead back. Paris Saint-Germain are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Snaffles his third, and that hurts him the match ball. That defence must be sick of the sight of him. It's been persistent and ruthless all game. It just hasn't stopped working. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Paris Saint-Germain go into the lead. Well, from such a showpiece final as well, I think this is exactly the type of excitement that all the neutrals would have wanted on show. There's so many twists and turns in this game. It's a pleasure to watch. Speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. Now it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Morata tried to play it through. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Pinged forward, and the counter is on. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! So close to drawing level. Oh, that's a great response, though, and it's a statement declaring that they're not done with this yet. Dybala plays it short. Quadrado delivers a cross. He's had a shot! Wijnaldum plays it forward. 
Juventus are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Keeper's got good distance on that. Hakimi plotting from out on the right-hand side. Oh, real danger here. He's left his man. Paris Saint-Germain are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Mbappe looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Well, better late than never, Peter, although it may not apply in this case um, after a chance! Juventus have a free kick. There's obvious upset over that challenge. You can see the players face to face. Let's hope this doesn't escalate. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Quite a thriller this one's become. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you take back again. Dybala tries to get it forward quickly. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Now that does look a foul, if he's given a free kick. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Extra time is imminent, unless something dramatic happens now. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. The breakaway clinical and clean, and the finish unerring. That's just brilliant counter-attacking football, and as soon as possession was theirs, it triggered a move of devastating speed that was just too hot to handle. Paris Saint-Germain take the lead, now it's just a question of holding on. Just listen, Peter, you can hear the excitement levels around the stadium now. The feeling is very much job done. I thought they need to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Juventus need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Has a goal! Di Maria. Di Maria plays it backwards, and they'll try again. Paris Saint-Germain can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. He's gone for it! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Dybala goes short. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Idrissa Gay does well to read it and intercepts. Borat tries a shot! But by that far, 
Cristiano Ronaldo certainly could have and should have made more of that. The final seconds now. Paris Saint-Germain just have to run down the clock. Mbappe. Defenders on the back foot. Well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain. They're not going to get back into the game like this. Morata. Morata! Yes, it's there! We thought it was over. It's all square once more. Oh, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement and when all of that is synchronized with the right pass that's what happens so all square with almost no time remaining out for a throw But it's Pablo Sarabia. Pablo Sarabia. Can he get through? Icardi turns and goes back. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. And he's managed to get that all wrong. All square after 90 minutes. There will be extra time. Yeah, this has been a hard-fought game, Peter. There's been a healthy dose of drive and ambition, and sometimes that is rewarded with goals just like this one. I've seen a lot worse, though. Fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. The action has already restarted. Paris Saint-Germain conceded an equaliser late. This is gone, that's a foul. Hakimi. Di Maria. Ball is over the line. Oh, it's Pablo Sarabia. Pablo Sarabia. Oh, it's a foul there right on the edge of the box. Paris Saint-Germain gifted a massive chance. Eyeball to eyeball with the goalkeeper. the way to take a penalty, stand up, pick your spot and blast it home. So we have a breakthrough, now how will things develop from here? Hoists it forward. And it's been taken straight back. Mbappe. What an adventurous run from a defender. And it's the goalkeepers to claim. Kimpembe. Icardi. And Icardi! And the ball's come out. And that would have won it. Maro Icardi was totally aware of how that chance could have impacted on the game, and that should have gone in. He could be in here. Oh, shooting chance! That's pretty clear, it is a foul. Well, he can get masterful control on free kicks, and his focus is usually second to none. Neymar with a real chance here. Neymar! This 
could fall anywhere. Great lead! It's anyone's ball. Idris Sake chooses to go back. Crunching tackle. Bernadeschi goes looking. Ronaldo tries lifting it over. Morata is the guilty party there. And he is going into that little black book. Quadrado <laughs> drives it forward. Across the field it goes. Quick ball forward. And here's Mauro Icardi. Di Maria. Di Maria! Sticks it away! Two up and threatening to pull clear. And a trademark move ends with the inevitable classy finish. Paris Saint-Germain are such an adept counter-attacking team. They produced something out of nothing there. A few seconds was all it took for them to convert a defensive situation into a goal. And it's very impressive. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition looked completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. And he's there to cut it out. Breaks on here. Icardi looking to penetrate opposition lines. Mbappe. Icardi. And Icardi! Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. Oh, that's a booking. Always looked it. Paris Saint-Germain looking to widen the gap even further here. He'll fancy himself from here. Of goalkeeping. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Bernadeschi puts it away. And the finish! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. They're probably getting frustrated by the lack of chances, I suppose. Hoists it forward. Marquinhos gets it back. Dybala, forward it goes. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Big chance! And oh! Goal at his mercy, and somehow... That's it for the first period of extra time. Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this pair. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. The hostilities have already resumed. The last 15 minutes, the closing stretch of a map. Pablo Sarabia! And it's there! And the lead is free! It is surely done! And that really is so, so impressive. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. Paris Saint-Germain grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. And here's Morata. Bonucci plays it forward. Chiesa chance to shoot! Chiesa with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Well positioned to make that interception. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo.
Just brushed off the ball there. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. And here's Morata. Morata plays a clever pass. Oh, that's an old goal! Well, that wasn't in the script, and you have to feel for him, Peter. It's ended in uh, some embarrassment. Well, who saw that coming? It has certainly made things interesting. Listen, sometimes you need that little bit of luck in games like these. Now it's Icardi. And Icardi! Now that's a real chance missed. Well, that ought to have wrapped it up, Peter. You may well regret that, you know. Dybala. Well, they could break here. But trying to hit the slide tackle there. The lift. Kimpembe plays it long. De Ligt with the clearance. Kimpembe needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Kimpembe. And it's Icardi. Narrow Icardi loses his balance and loses the ball. Played out to the right. And here's Dybala. Whipped in. He's gone for it! Movement there, but not the best of finishes. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. To lift, cuts it out. It's one! He has done it! What about that, Jim Beglin? It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. So now the difference is three. Chiesa! Chiesa! Oh, shooting chance! And in it goes! Uh, he was never going to miss from there. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. So, is this the start of a comeback? Drexler. Looking for space out wide. Has a pop! A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Well, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. 
Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant set-up and finish. And it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. And that's that. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history.